Hey everybody, it's Doc Green, the Road Scholar, back out here on Saturday morning, coming at you. Um, I've been home on my home time. Uh, I've been doing a lot of videos and little pictures and posts and everything about the 16th second. I'm gonna do a little explanation again of what that is before I get into this video. The 16th second is a video I watched by a valedictorian of a school who spent all his years trying to be, become valedictorian after he graduated. He spent just about 15 seconds of euphoria and in the 16th second, he regretted not hanging out with his friends, family, going places, doing things, everything just chasing the grades that really meant nothing after he graduated high school. It, he already had scholarships and everything, so it didn't help him get into schools, didn't help him get better jobs or anything. So basically, he just spent all his time chasing a goal that only lasted 15 seconds of orientation. So that's the reason I started titling some of these videos in 16 seconds. I'm back home today in Garland, Texas with my beautiful wife over here. Say hi, Carmen. <laughs> and uh, we're enjoying the 16th second. I took time off yesterday, came home. Actually, the coffee house we're in is called Rosalind's Coffee down here in Garland, Texas. And um, this is actually where we got married at, actually in this coffee house. It was called uh, the Generator at the time, right? The Generator Coffee House. But we got married right in this exact, actually exact spot we're sitting in now, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. A couple feet over, but anyway, so we came back down here for this morning to have a cup of coffee. Uh, I got a pumpkin uh, cup of cake. My wife got a spinach quiche over there. You can see, <laughs> and we are going to enjoy a little bit of time together this morning. We left the kid at home. We snuck out this morning, kind of creeped out. He's at home, so uh, we're enjoying our 16 second. This is what I worked so hard for, so that I could have these little moments, little times, and everything. And I want to make sure that at the end of the day that I don't have any regrets. So I come home, see my family, <clears throat> visit with friends. Uh, tonight I have to go to one of my cousin's parties and uh, spend some time over there, visit some family I haven't seen in a very, very long time. So I'll be doing that tonight. And I might do a little bit of video on that. But guys, just want to remind you about the 16th second. You'll spend your entire life chasing a dream. You'll get your goal. Let's say it's a, it's a bigger house or whatever. You get your goal. You're happy for a couple of months, then you're endorphin levels go back down your excitement goes back down just becomes normal so don't neglect everything around you such as family and friends chasing after the big dream because the big dream is only going to make you feel better for a small period where the memories with your family and friends such as me and my wife getting married in this place um that memory will last forever you know and coming back here visiting this place this, these are the things that will really last so Enjoy the 15, enjoy the chase, enjoy the 15 seconds, but make sure you don't neglect your relationships with your family, your friendships, and your relationships with God chasing that 15 second euphoric feeling. Have a good one.